already said my grace. You know, I already said mine was when I was standing over here because I'm thirsty. <laughs> Today is Saturday, November 20th. Yes, the freaking month is almost over. It's practically gone. But I am about to have some breakfast slash brunch with my good Judy friend. Hey. You want me to say your name? Sure. <laughs> <Freak> show. <laughs> so this is my good friend. Um, her YouTube channel is Nectar's Freak Show. Check it out. Everything will be in the description box below. But look, subscribe. she made exactly subscribe. She made breakfast for us. Yeah, and I, hope it looks good. I was about to say, don't it look delicious? Hold on, I'm gonna turn it around. Oh, let me hurry up. It look good, yummy. And this is my um, what you call this? Uh, plant-based bacon, y'all. Yeah, that too. <laughs> yes. So we finna chow down. Hey you guys, it's Dinah and welcome back to my channel. I am with my very, very good friend and this is Freak of Nectar. Hey y'all. Make sure you check out her YouTube channel, Nectar's Freak Show. A lot of nice, interesting, juicy videos there. Um, so basically we are getting ready to chow down. My bestie just cooked. We're about to have some brunch. We have eggs i got um vegan bacon um plant-based we both got toast and shrimp and grits with cheese because we know how to eat it's good and we got our infused water with cucumber lemon and lime give you a little food pouring real quick yeah boom, boom. Too big. Too big. Right. <laughs> it's always a good time when we're together because we just get to be ourselves and talk about whatever we feel like. True that. Without feeling like, oh, the people we're around are not understanding or judgmental. Right. Or they just... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We just tell it like it is. So that's really what you're going to be getting the tea. But I'm gonna eat this good food. Mm -hmm. So give me a second. I'm hungry, y'all. I can't yeah. wait. <laughs> mm. That was good. See if I see the nigga. Mm hmm. Oh my god, I wish you like the season. Mm hmm. I love it. Let me try this bacon. So y'all know I'm like plant-based, but sometimes I eat seafood. So when I go grocery shopping, I always like to get plant-based alternatives. Bacon, pizza rolls, burgers, links, whatever. She turned me on to her pizza rolls. Mm -hmm. I thought that was good. I'm like, okay now. This tastes- like plant-based. This tastes just like turkey. Like, did you know turkey bacon? Turkey bacon, mm -hmm. yeah. I tasted it while it was cold. Mm -hmm. This one tastes better mixed with these eggs. Mm. Mm, some jelly on it. Yes, we got the grape jelly on deck. This toast is so good. Mmm. Shrimp is nice and hot and ready. I always gotta take my little shells off before I add into it. Okay, I got no interruptions. I can just mine right at the Chow You seasoned that good. It's shrimp, yeah. Mm. You know me, you know I play about my seasoning. <laughs> I love seasoning. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not with that just black pepper and salt stuff. Right. Mm -hmm. That's that much restaurant, so. I need cayenne. I need a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Mm -hmm. Some Cajun seasoning. Oh, that's what I put on the shrimp. Cajun seasoning. Mm -hmm. I, got I like a little bit of spicy. Yeah. Spicy food is good for you because it's good for your uh, digestive system. Yeah, that, that's true. It's gonna come right out of here. <laughs> And 
and certain peppers help stimulate hair growth. Kind of. <laughs> oh no, not like the real pepper, like the like the seasoned peppers. Okay, that's all of it. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay, so I'm gonna the slow jam playing in the background. I know. Mm -hmm. There's a little music in my head. I'm sure they can hear it in the middle corner. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Don't put a hot sauce on your eggs. Just Heck no. Nah. Some people do that. Right. Or uh, ketchup. No, we're not doing mm -hmm. that. It should put cheese on it. And some, like this, some jelly, and that's it. Good to go. Oh, you just slapping. Mm -hmm. right on me. <laughs> That's what I was like. I probably put too much on there. Mm -hmm. No, you do it that way. That's all y'all making? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, sis. <laughs> Tell the people a little bit about you so they can know who Nectar is and why should we tune into her freak show? Y'all. <laughs> well, I like to think my channel is eccentric, you can say. It's eclectic. I do yeah. different things like mukbangs, uh, movie reviews, restaurant reviews. Mm -hmm. um, whatever she feel like. Recording. Yeah, like whatever my mood is, you know. It's basically just my personality just thrown onto YouTube. Y'all need to tune in today. Y'all don't want to miss that. So what kind of personality are we talking about? Well, eccentric, like I said, um, I'm diverse, so I like doing different things in life, you know, interesting things. But um, I'm trying to think, like one of my recent videos that I made, I basically did it on TikTok. <laughs> but um, I like to do like theme stuff too. I'm creative, mm -hmm. so I think that's fun. Like one of my recent movie reviews was um, on Chucky. I, I, <laughs> I saw to, I that. Recommend that show. <laughs> it looked lame. I didn't want to watch it. It's lame. I did a couple reviews on that, but like I did like a thing, like I dressed up like Chucky. I already had a similar outfit. Then I so happened to buy it. <laughs> so you know, I'm real creative. I think that's uh, interesting and exciting to watch. You know. She's her own person, unapologetically. Yeah, I just unfiltered. Do, I just do me. I'm definitely unfiltered. I mean, I don't have time for all of that. I don't allow humans to control how I move in life. You know, right. you either like it or you don't. Right. There's the door. There's your nearest exit. Exactly. If you don't like it, then don't be around me. Right. Don't tune into it. I'm trying to. But yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm straightforward. I'm gonna tell it like it is. So, and I know not everybody can handle that. So, if you don't gravitate towards it, right, then just mess with somebody else. You know, your tribe will find you. Right. You don't need to find it. Right. You don't need to try to change yourself up to be accepted by people because. The persona that they will be accepting is not yours. So the person that they're liking is not you. Mm -hmm. I was trying to look. Did you see I was struggling? I was trying to crunch mine. I like to make a little sandwich. Like if I got some bread with my food, I like to make a little sandwich with it. Mm. Yeah, you extra like you just slab on your jelly. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. I like to mix my food together, that's why. Mm -hmm. So, like, no separation, you know, all coming together. Same as your food, you know? mm -hmm. So, how would you describe my personality? Like, with, like with Independent, individual. Um, I think I can be a little kooky sometimes too. But a little quasi in a good way. Like y'all know I'm different. I'm my own person, so that's why I like her. So I don't see certain things as like weird. I see it like being open and I like it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Spiritual, a queen. Low, conscious, beautiful. That was so dry. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, like I just smoked the whole blunt to myself just now. <laughs> just very um, lively and expressive and open. Yeah, lively for sure. That's the word. She is like the perfect human being because. I like people that just be themselves. They live their life. They let their light shine. They don't spread hate. They spread love, joy. But they don't judge others. Sorry, I'm talking with my mouth full. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, but Elisa doesn't sound like it. Uh -huh, good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got it. big teeth to help with that. Chomp, chomp, chomp. But mm -hmm. same with you. I think we have. A lot of those things in common. Like you're lively. I think you may be a, like a little bit more reserved than me. What do you think? <laughs> Probably. Um, or at least sometimes. In some I, ways. I'm selective when I show my full self. Like yeah. I like to scan the scene to see, because I'm not going to expose myself to anybody. Well, I'm definitely that way in mm -hmm. person. Mm -hmm. But I guess as far as like social media, I'm like out there. Oh yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, social media I am more reserved. I mean, obviously on my YouTube channel, they know I be like showing and sharing a lot. <clears throat> like I openly talk yeah. about sex and stuff. I oh, won't be spilling the tea there, huh? And like when I be tipsy, I have be saying a little sexual stuff. Oh my goodness, y'all! Just one time, my mama used to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Because I used to do, you know, it's my life. I just was recording my life. So at one point in my life, I was like really spiritual. So I was doing like a lot of godly videos, just talking about scriptures and the Lord, like Bible study stuff. Just, you know, being passionate about my relationship with the Lord. And so my mama was subscribed to my YouTube channel. Then as a new phase of my life began, and that's what like some of y'all fail to understand is nobody remains the same their whole life. Life is a journey, life is about growth. Just because you started at one place don't mean you're gonna finish there. And just because you're currently in one position don't mean you're gonna be there the rest of your life. So, everything is a stage and a phase. So don't like try to write people off because of their current stage, you know? But anyways, so as I started doing like more uh, content pertaining to like exotic dancing and that, I told my mom, I said, do not watch my videos anymore. You can stay subscribed, but don't watch my videos anymore. And she kept watching my videos. And so obviously I had a boyfriend and we were like heavily involved, serious and sexually active. And so um, I made a funny little video in one of my vlogs where I was like talking about swallowing, you know, like when you give oral sex to a male and you swallow his semen. So I, I made a little little snippet about my first time swallowing semen because mm. of course I do oral sex but I ain't never swallowed nobody's kids <laughs> and so and what mama say she, my sister told me she didn't um say anything to me my sister told me my mama would watch that video and she said yeah I had to stop watching Medina's videos because she uh she was um instructing us how to swallow and I'm like, no, I wasn't instructing y'all how to swallow. I was telling you while I was doing it. I told you to stop watching my videos because it became very explicit. <laughs> it was not family friendly appropriate. But it was really embarrassing because I was like, 
I never told my mama that I was sexually active because A, that's none of her business. I don't like, I'm not one of those girls who talk to their parents about sex because that's, that has nothing to do with Why? I'm not gonna talk to just anybody about sex either. I'm gonna talk to my close friend because we gotta comment on it. We gotta talk about the experience, what happened. And so I'm gonna talk to my friend. Um, I don't get personal with my sister. I'll just mention like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just mention like, oh, boo up the bam happened, but I'm not finna be like, oh yeah, girl, it went like this. We was wearing this. We had the baby wool, blah, 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 blah. Like, no, I'm not finna be giving details. Like, oh, he had me busted open. Yeah, like, we not finna be, that's, that's nasty. Like, why do you want to give your family members visual aids of your, you know, intimate moment? Like, that's nasty. Yeah. Or at least that's my perspective. I don't know how y'all be down, but we not, that's correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have a relative that relate to me that their daughter had told them that they like getting like smacked in the face during stuff. Like, why are, why you, are you telling, why are you telling that? that to your dad? To the daddy? Yeah. And what the daddy do? He don't. He's worldly behind. Don't care. He just related to me. I would not never tell my daddy anything about sex. That's nasty. I know. It's, it's funny. Mm -hmm. That's good. Right. I'm not saying to each his own, but I'm not doing it. Yeah, I never felt the need to do that to just openly talk about sex to anybody in my family. Because mm -mm. we're relatives. So we're not. I see if it's like a cousin, like a homegirl. Mm -hmm. you know? We're related. We're not. Right. We're not casual friends or something. Exactly. No sexual imagery for family. <laughs> yeah. It's unnecessary. Mm -hmm. You been full? Not yet. <laughs> this is the first thing I've eaten all day. Y'all know I do one meal a day. Got some good eats. Some good mm -hmm. eating. I gotta go to work tonight, so this will definitely be gone by then. My club does not open till seven on the weekends. I thought they at least open at four on weekends. Mm -mm. They a late club. They open at four during the week. Mm -hmm. I like when clubs be open early. You could be in and get that early money out. Probably Sometimes you just want to be in and out. I don't really like nights. Like I don't really like working nights. I'm mm -hmm. like a morning person. I don't think so. You've been working nights lately, though. <laughs> Cause. If, if I'm not making enough money, I gotta stay until I make something that's satisfactory or right. decent. Mm -hmm. Trust me, I know mm how -hmm. oh, I was when I was dancing. I, mean, I don't care how many hours it is. I'm right. putting in blood, sweat, and tears. We got to get paid. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is good. Today. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, y'all. We're gonna get more talkative as we do more of these little mukbangs. I gotta get used to it. <laughs> I talk more when I'm like drinking or smoking. Okay, Am I sober? In my sober life, I be so chill. <laughs> I be quiet, like she said. I be like, I'm fine. I'm sure y'all can tell. Mm -hmm. I'm a natural introvert mm -hmm. slash extrovert now. Go to her um, Instagram. You gonna see she be having a I'm lot a, to talk about. I'm an extrovert on my Instagram. When you go to her Instagram, you gonna be like, uh, uh. Where was this side at when she was chowing down? <laughs> No, it's different when you're eating. What? Mm -hmm. Oh, talking. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And my Instagram, y'all, is freak underscore of underscore nectar. 
and freight is with a E, of is with a zero, and nectar is with a E. So two E's and one zero in the middle. Freak underscore of underscore nectar. <laughs> I'm so complicated. <laughs> Go check her out. But with Instagram, you have to be complicated because everybody be having the same name, so you gotta use underscores, exclamation marks, okay. numbers. Have to use a long name anyway. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to talk about Suicide Squad? Oh, yeah. I mm -hmm. saw that Suicide Squad yesterday, the new one. We mm -hmm. all the Suicide Squad. Yeah, we watched it last night because I never saw any of it. I don't really watch like the Batman type of movies, but I wanted to see it because it seemed interesting, so we watched it. It was... You watched the whole two hours. Yeah, I watched the whole thing. It was decent. I was not though. Not that long. Some parts were cheesy and expected, but it, it was good. You know how you could, you're aware someone is acting? Like, it don't feel like it's really that character. This girl, when she watches movies, mm -hmm. she has to be logical about everything, mm -hmm. right. about every movie. Mm -hmm. Like, we just can't watch a horror comedy. No. I, I showed you one before. Yeah, she showed me two of them last night. No, you didn't. No, no. It was, uh... No, this was not, well, not yesterday, but, like, before you had moved back to Indiana or, or whatever, wherever. Yeah. Um, I had showed mm -hmm. you, it's called The Babysitter. Mm -hmm. It's a horror comedy. This child, she's mm -hmm. logical the whole way through. Like you can't mm -hmm. take movies like that serious. They're irrational. It's so weird because I'll be breaking it's movies like, down. It's just like I want you to like enjoy it, like just understand the concept and then enjoy mm -hmm. it. But like I understand if you're you're just like super rational to where you mm -hmm. can. Y'all know <laughs> I'm analytical, so I'm gonna be up in there like eh, wrong. I'm like that won't happen in Let's real see. life. I'm more easy going there. <laughs> I'm a critic. <laughs> no, that no, that just means she she the B word, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I got high standards because I'm a writer. I write. And I'm interested in doing movies. Ain't nothing wrong with that though. So it's like when you're a creative person. And yeah, you looking at other creators' work, and you gonna be looking at it. Mm -hmm. This stuff is so good, y'all. All right, I'm back here. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, okay. If y'all ain't never had shrimp and grits, come on now. I'm estimating it. Mm -hmm. I mean, I should have put a little bit more water in after a while, after they started to be done, almost done. Mm -hmm. So it was a little bit too thick for my taste, but mm -hmm. it's still good, though. Mm -hmm. It's seasoned right. Mm. Mm I definitely lick my fingers. I'm a finger licker. That's why you gotta make sure you wash your hands before you chow down. That's how you know you really enjoy your meal. <laughs> my plate is empty, y'all. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She ate more than me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, my plate is. There you go. Just a little bit more eggs mm -hmm. Yeah, she really got a little bit of crunch. She basically mm -hmm. ate the whole thing. I mean, I did kind of cheat. I smoked a little bit, but still. Mm -hmm. Smoking. Fills you up or something? No, well it opens up my stomach. I'll just make it more of an appetite. 
I'm about to stay smoking and give me the munchies. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm full, y'all. Any parting words? Um, mm -hmm. I don't have any. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I hope y'all enjoy me. This is I like, hope y'all enjoy me. Yeah, this is like the first time they see me, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Depending on what, what, what video I post. <laughs> mm -hmm. I know they saw you in my last video, a clip of you. Oh, yeah. Remember? Some little clips. Yeah, mm -hmm. little clips. Y'all get like the full introduction of, of free. Yeah, a freak. A full introduction of freak. That's funny. All right, y'all. She's going to smoke. I'm probably going to nibble on something else. Like? Sure. <laughs> oh, girl. I'm so full. Like, this is how I be after I eat, like, a full meal, y'all. I be like, it takes something out of you. I just be like, woo, long with you. Wait on you. Oh, she showed me this thing on YouTube, y'all. Y'all should go watch it, check it out. I'll put the link down in the description box below. It was like some. It, it was supposed to be like horror short movies, but oh, it wasn't I was gonna that. It. It, it was called. Uh, what it's called, Alvin. Yeah, that one was not. As, it was good, but it was not as good as the second one to me. Right. For me. And the other one is called NSFW. Not suitable for work. So if y'all be seeing that, like me, I Google stuff I don't know, like certain text, uh, you know, little text meaning. So like when y'all see N S F W, it means not suitable for work. I don't even know what that means. Yeah, it means like usually it's intended for like sexy stuff. Like ooh, not in the right place. Knowing y'all little perverts be out at y'all work desk, uh, looking at stuff. Ain't no wrong with it, I suppose. As long as you somewhere in the world, room. somebody got that tramp stamp. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they got that tattoo somewhere. That's funny. Mm -hmm. But yeah, Alvin and NSFW are for short films. And they're a part of the Screen Fest productions on YouTube. So y'all can check those out along with the other ones. But they're, mm -hmm. they're interesting. They're fun. I like them. Boop. Mm -hmm. If y'all know me and you ever eat with me, you gonna hear me say that like a good 12 times that I'm full. Yeah. I just be like, I think I'm gonna have this cinnamon roll. That's what I'm gonna do. Right, like we gotta finally eat those. Yeah. <laughs> Let me back up on so I don't look like a crackhead. <laughs> oh no, I'm covering up my friend. I can still smell that food. Let me get closer. I copied her today. I put my little black dress on. Otherwise, I'd be wearing lounge chill clothes. Two two two. Two twenty two. I look cute. Oh, God. All right, you guys. I'm about to eat the last little bit of this food. I just made me a little a second portion. Added more cheese. Mm. Um. So we're gonna close out the video. You wanna come say goodbye to the people? Guys. <laughs> Peace out, y'all. Bye. Bye. Mwah.